So just another quick video on Virtual DJ 2024 based on the question in the Virtual DJ forum. It's actually, it was more like a change request because there was a guy asking if you could have, have hot cues or cue points uh, uh, listed or shown uh, on the waveform when you use the track waveform down here in the browser section. So here, so for instance, this track that I've loaded, you can clearly see it has pure eyes. You can also see down here that it actually has four hot cues. Uh, but down here, you can't see it. And that's what, what he wanted. And unfortunately, that's not really uh, possible yet, but it's still a, a change request in the form. But what he wanted it for was he wanted to, to know which one didn't have any hot cues, so he knew which ones to work on uh, that he needed to prepare to go out to DJ. Uh, so really an indicator, and that indicator is easily to get, uh, easy to get. So we can definitely do that. And that's really what I want to show in this video. Uh, so basically the same thing as I replied to the change request. Um, so you might want to think it was a column, right? Uh, but there's no real column here that could do this. Could be that was a column like the one here on key with just a marker saying which ones here. But no, that's not the case. There's no column. So what do we have then? Well, we have some, some instant filters over here. Uh, and that's what you can do if you want this, if you want to know about hot cues even before loading the track. So let's try to go in here. We could do a quick filter. So just show the tracks, but we could also color code them. So that's what we'll do, do in this video. So what I really just want to do is add a color rule like this one, and I'll pick a uh, color course and let's just do it purple. So it's really clear to see. And then I uh, choose the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, this saying has Q points. So that's the one you want to use to, to find this out, to illustrate this. And that's really a Boolean. So uh, the value is zero or one. So right now I could put in one to show all the one that has hot cues, or I can put in zero like I'll do now to show all the tracks that doesn't have hot cues, don't have hot cues. And that's this one only. So if I close this down again, you can see that uh, if I load this, it indeed doesn't have any hot cues. You can also see it here. So what about all the other ones? Do they really all have hot cues? Well, we can do a few tests. That has lots of them. That has, that has. So only one track without hot cues. Let's try go to the other folder and see what happens. So if I go browse down here a little bit, okay, that's a few more. So these are the ones that I probably wanna uh, uh, prepare a bit before going DJing the next time. Cause you might want a few hot cues so you know, or cue points so you know where, where to mix, right? So uh, that's really it. So that's really it. So you can do this has cue points equal zero uh, as a color. Uh, it's a color rule, and then uh, you'll get the ones that I have no hot cues. You can also do the one, and then you'll get all the other ones, right? So zero for the one that doesn't have it, and one for the ones that do have it, like that. There's a little caveat though, uh, because if the virtual DJ doesn't know anything about the track, it doesn't know what to do. So for instance, if I go to online folder here, and I go down to a title, no, Deezer probably, and then I do my this folder, you can see it says, well, he has a couple of ones that indeed have hot cues. That's good. But what if I put in zero? Sorry. I also get a few, but that's also a lot of them that uh, never change this color. And that's because they've never been loaded. So right now, if I load this track for the very first time on this laptop, on this database, if you will, then it instantly turns purple because it has no cue points. But it doesn't know yet for the other ones. And of course, if I then set a hot cue here, then it turns white again and gray. So uh, that's the way it works. Uh, if you want an indicator uh, on which tracks have hot cues, just a little caveat that the tracks the virtual DJ don't know anything about, they'll just stay uncolored uh, regardless uh, if you put in, it should have a hot cues by putting in this one, or it shouldn't have hot cues by putting in zero, they'll just stay unaffected.